guys, it's Phoebe. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a room tour and uh, one thing that I want to address very quickly or preface is that my room doesn't have walls. Let me just quickly explain so we can get right into the video. I have a brother currently. He is planning on moving out soon. So I have this for now. Um, I really, really wanted my own space, my own just relaxing time because I really feel like it's so freeing to have my own space considering that I am 14 now and I shared a room with my sister since I was alive. But this is the current situation, and I'm really happy with it. I'm really grateful I have my own room. Let's get right into the tour. So right before, again, I get into like the main, main, main tour, um, these curtains, I want to address a few are from Amazon. I am planning on getting some new curtains, and I'm a favorite design, but I have them up on this hook. Uh, pillar right up on the ceiling with these little hooks can see up here. Mm, the curtains aren't my favorite. Uh, I would like more privacy, but I like for what they are right now. Okay, so right as you walk into my room, you're going to see my bed, so we're going to do my bed first. I have a full-size bed right here. I'm not really sure where my bed is from, but this bed frame is from Amazon. I love this bed frame. It is so cute. And I have these little Christmas lights going down my bed and when the lights are turned off it is chef's kiss it is so pretty especially with the led lights that i also have from amazon i have this throw from vera bradley and then i have all of these stuffed animals but all these pillows if you want me to go more in depth go ahead and let me know <laughs> sorry let me know um and then i just have this very basic white comforter which i do really like because mm, i just really like basic things I really like how basic my bed is. So yes, that's my bed. Right next to my bed is my nightstand, which when we got this, my mom literally paid, I think it was um, like $50 for this. Um, it has this drawer, which is dirty and kind of gross, but I keep my, my books, I keep hair accessories in it, then I keep my LED light remote right here on top and my Invisalign case. Uh, then I have this, some book, and then I use my charging cable and I put my phone right here when I'm charging it right before I go to bed. So I do like this, but it was so funny when we paid for it because it was so small. Um, it's definitely very practical. I like it, but again, I don't really like the look of it. So moving on up the wall, um, I have this poster from Five Below, which I'm not in love with. But I keep it here because um, I'm putting on putting my Stranger Things poster back up the wall. So I'm probably going to change that. And then right by my bed, you probably noticed, I have this little, what do you call it, a, a bed end that I can show you the inside of. So when you open this up, I have uh, my TV remote right there. But when you open this up, you I have clothes here and then I have like a, just a bunch of socks, swimsuit. These are just like extra clothes that I couldn't fit in my dresser, which I will show you in one minute. But yeah, I like this. I think this was from Amazon. It's really not my favorite because it's pretty not sturdy. It's cracked, mainly because of my brother. But yeah, this is what that looks like next to this. I think it looks pretty nice and I'm gonna keep it here because it's really good for storage. Okay, right before we move on to my dresser, uh, I have this really, really cute yellow trash can that like flips, but it doesn't because it's filled up with trash right now. Uh, I often empty this out, like it's so helpful to have a trash can right in your room. So I definitely recommend getting a trash can, especially a cute one because trash is not cute. Moving on to my dresser, this is a color that I didn't actually pick out, and that is um, this orange color. This was a dresser that we painted that we originally had down here. It was actually up against this wall instead. And then right here on the dresser, I have all of my skincare. So I have this gel mask. I have this Grapefruit Rosé Bath & Body Works perfume, which I love, like my favorite scent. 
And I have this mango mandarin scent that is so old. I have this Garnier micellular water. And right next to that I have a, oh my gosh, toilet paper roll. Because I can't tell you how many times I've needed toilet paper. <laughs> I don't know why. I just like always end up needing toilet paper. So I use that a lot. And then I have my face wash, my CeraVe foaming facial cleanser. I have only like makeup items. If you guys want an in-depth skincare routine from me, go ahead and let me know. Because I'm not going to go through all of that right now. I have only makeup there. If you want a makeup routine, go ahead and let me know. I'm not going to go through that fully. Then I have my brush, my signature wet brush, which works for everything. I have this case that I usually keep my headphones in. I don't really have AirPods, but I have um, Raycons. And then I have my straightener here. Because I really like to straighten my hair. I already have straight hair. But... Like today, for se, I straightened my hair and I really liked the look of it. So yeah, I like to do that. And then I have this globe here with all of my jewelry on it. And I don't really have a lot of jewelry. I'm trying to build my collection. I have some rings down here. I have some earrings, but my earrings are mainly in these drawers. And I'm going to go through these drawers right now. Okay, so here's the first drawer. I really need to back out because I don't have a lot of space right here. But here is the first drawer, which we're going to open and set this on here. So right now, uh, going into it, I have these Simtex. I have some makeup. I have these elastic rubber bands that I like to do for hairstyles. And these are all my earrings. I have a set of earrings at Five Below. I'm planning on getting more earrings. Um, I have two eyeliner palettes over here. I have an alternative makeup remover, but I really like to stick to my, the micellular water. Moving on here, this is very rare that I have like anything else other than clothes, but I have this Lush bath bomb that I'm planning on using this weekend. And I have a sweater, shirts, some really cute sweatpants, that is that drawer. And then I don't really know what else you'd expect from a dresser, but I have just more clothes. And then in these last two drawers, these are just chuck full of blankets that are not mine. Keep these because we need extra storage. So I'm the type of person who really loves Harry Potter. I got this um, magazine at Sam's Club that I liked, so I cut things out, like Molly Weasley. The last book, I got all of the, like, their cute little pictures, look at how cute they are. And I have them in the Order of the Phoenix, another one in the Order of the Phoenix. Yeah. And I have this, I cut that out, I have a little Butterbeer. I have, um, oh my gosh, I don't, I forget her name, but I have Daniel Radcliffe and totally forget her name um dobby i have like the train scene from chamber of secrets I have, like this random picture of her bonnie Wright. uh but yeah i just thought this was like kind of cute i want to fill up some space my brother um went to a oh my gosh went to a friend's house and he was moving he was giving away some stuff so he gave this to my brother and i said oh let me take that that'll look really cute in the corner of my room I don't believe in dream catchers at all. I really think it's so cute. So I picked it up. And then um, this mirror actually, where I live, we have this thing called Big Garbage. And I got this off the side of the road. And Big Garbage is basically where you can put up all of your clutter and things that you want to get rid of. And a dumpster will come around and take all your stuff. So people usually like to shuffle through other people's things before everything goes. And you can take anything. So I said, hey, this is really cute. And it was a really good decision. I do my makeup here. I do so many things here. It was such a good decision. I love this mirror. I also posted some really cute Instagram pics. And then I'm just moving on to very, very last touches um, in this room. And that is this towel rack. I just got a single hook from Hobby Lobby and I keep all my towels. I keep a little backpack. I keep another backpack there. I just like to keep a lot of things that can just hang. Then I got this from Five Below. I get a lot of things from Five Below. I also didn't show you this. This is like a burnt out candle from Target that I put all of my <laughs> beloved chapstick. I have, oh my gosh, I cannot take this out. I have like a s'mores collection. Uh, a soda collection. I got these markers from that whiteboard over there and I put the markers and all my lip balm in there. <laughs> so I love that container. It's very cute. And then the very last thing I think in here is this, which I will show you up close. So this little relic is from my grandmother. I love her. Um, I go visit her in Canada sometimes. And then we have this little candle that says bookshop on it. Then I have this little succulent, which I like. My brother made this little pot. And then I have this from um, my, not cousin, but our friends that live down in Florida. And then I have this calendar from Five Below, which I have not changed. I'm going to change that. Then I have this, which I think I'm going to change soon. 
but it's like a little um, North Pole thing. I'm currently with all my children, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, make sure you smash that like button, <laughs> subscribe right over there, turn on the post notification bell so you're notified every time I post, because YouTube doesn't like to push out certain people's content. Uh, make sure to DM me on Instagram if you want to talk to me. Um, I will leave my Instagram linked down below. It is a private Instagram, so you're going to have to say that you're from my YouTube channel, but if you do want to talk to me, go ahead and go over there.